Let's go. Jesus! No, 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 uh, gun, gun, gun. Uh, not a quick draw so far. I have been looking forward to this game since Propagation VR. So, finally, we got a full game. That's crazy, everything that's happening. I miss you, Ashley. I hope you're all right. That sounds like Owen needs help. As you can tell, we're in the middle of a zombie apocalypse. And if you know, Propagation VR is a zombie shooter. So this is a full story mode version of a survival game. Did you break something? Owen, is everything okay? No, it's not, Emily. Not at all. That was our last yard. Ah, no more peanut butter. How will we ever survive? Haha. <laughs> no, but seriously, with the food that's left, how much longer can we last? Um. I'd say a few days, maybe a little over a week if we're organized. Well, it only took the end of the world for me to finally start a diet. At least my wife's gonna be over the moon. The door won't hold much longer. We really need some help to get out of here. Where putting colliders on your hand actually makes you feel like you're touching more. You don't have to stand there. I'll call you if I pick up something. We found ourselves in the kitchen ten days ago. Some infected detected us and forced us into retreat here. A group quickly assembled to leave the hotel, armed with knives and other kitchen utensils. Shortly after they left, we heard screams. There's only five of us left. Emily, the bartender, won't shut up about her sister. I'm getting sick of it. As she was supposed to be working the upper floors when all hell broke loose. She probably... she's probably dead. Like everyone else. I can't speak the truth to her face. But she needs to move on if she wants to survive. When we get out of here, we can only think about our own survival. Disappeared to date. Isabella Noro, Kai Wong, Vanessa Hopkins. Travis Martin, Colton Smith, Mr. and Mrs. Durad, and undoubtedly many more. May their souls rest in peace. Ryan McCoy. <clears throat> the fly got straight into my eye. It hurts like hell. It's starting to swell. I'm afraid I'll lose an eye if I don't see a doctor quickly. Kelly has a plan to get us out. It's risky. We don't have much choice. I'll leave my will here in case I don't make it out alive. Donate my clothes to charity. My kitchen equipment can be distributed to the whole family. I'll be careful to sharpen my knives. Mom, Dad, Emma, Ben, I love you very much. Carmen, I never had the courage to tell you, but you caught the eye. You caught my eye ever since our first meeting. I won't miss a chance next time we see each other. I can't stand this kitchen anymore.
That seemed like a good plan. You still think about the others? Yeah, I can't help it. They were so convinced this escape plan would work. The screams in the basement. I feel like I can still hear them. But we're alive. Yes, we're alive. We decided to get out of the kitchen. We've been confined for a week. It's very risky. This happening is not natural at all. We all decided we'll make it uh, in case we don't get out. I thought back on our conversation about death, about what's next. I think the door was closed, and that's why the dead are coming back to life. I'm certain that the afterlife exists. I hope to reach it one day. Not like those damned souls. There are too many things I would like to say to everyone in my school, my friends, my family. Tell everyone that I love them very much. To you, there are so many things that I want to do with you. Have a house, a dog, children, who knows. Hope this plan works out. I love you, Kelly Vidal. Yeah, please. No, Owen. Guns are your domain. No. Nope. My job here is just making fancy cocktails, you know? Oh, Give it to me. On. Imagine the door breaks down while I'm uh, answering the call of nature. You must be able to protect us. It is essential. <laughs> okay. All right. I'll do it so you can take your morning dumps in peace. Okay. Take this. Start with putting the magazine. Now pull the slide. Try to shoot all the pants down. Keep going. Okay, let's stop there. Well, let's hope you won't need to use it. It's harder than I thought. Where's that? <sighs> You've been too loud. Well, then, fun's over. Give me the gun back. I'll put it away. This is a broadcast from the U.S. Army to the civilian population. All healthy and non-infected people are invited to come forward in order to be evacuated to a safe place. To be rescued under suitable conditions, please move to a clear extraction point allowing for the landing of a helicopter. Uh, hello? This is Sergeant Gray. Go ahead. My name is Ashley Diaz. I'm at the Paradise Hotel. Please come quickly. I see. A squad will be dispatched over this area in a few hours. Remember, only civilians located in a secure perimeter can be evacuated. I can't talk much. You'll hear me. I'll be waiting for you on the roof. Please, hurry. Roger that. Meanwhile, avoid getting bitten or scratched. The disease is extremely contagious. Be careful. Over and out. That was my sister. Oh, Ashley, I knew she was alive. I knew it, Owen. Yeah, I heard. And I'm thinking, since she has a radio transmitter, she's got to be in the surveillance room on the seventh floor. Then it's settled. We have to go. Uh, wait, hold up. Calm down. Look, Owen, it's now or never. We have to find Ashley and get the hell out of here. The door won't hold much longer, and we're running out of food. So it's with or without you, but I am going to find my sister. All right, okay, you're right. But let's not rush out head first. Let's stick together, stay quiet, and gear up. Here, take this. At least you'll be able to carry stuff and have your hands free. Nice. I'm gonna open this door. My sister is alive, Owen. Yeah, yeah and he's gonna die every I minute know. now. We'll find her. We should stay together from now on. Come next to me. <laughs> Push her away! Hit her! <laughs> Jesus. Well, that was close. Are you okay? No? I'm injured! Here, take the spray. Spray it on you. 
you'll feel better. Careful, it runs out pretty fast. You'll have to fill it up with bottles of antiseptic. But I'm... You better not stick around too long. They always wake up. But I'm bitten. Go ahead, I got you back. Cigarettes? No? I'm scared I'll recognize people I know. Don't get too close. We don't know if they're infected. I hope they'll find a way to cure them. Yeah, me too. But in the meantime, let's try not to end up like them. Wait, I'm gonna lift this so we can go under it. Maybe give me your gun first? Maybe go over it instead. Go ahead. <sighs> I'm right behind you. This guy is dead. I don't. No. You ready? It's so strange. The 
It's never that quiet here, usually. It's even a little too quiet to feel right in here. I'm guessing the elevators don't work. Notice to all Paradise Hotel staff, we are honored to welcome the esteemed uh, wrestlers Dumb and D. Tweedle once again starting Monday. Tweedle Dumb and Tweedle D, really? Starting Monday and for a mini period two I wonder weeks. If they're still alive. Yeah, they're bosses. Guaranteed. Okay, something tells me we have to go in here. Before going in there, we're gonna check upstairs. Guy dead? I don't think so. Your room, the establishment welcomes your from 4 p.m. to reception to collect your keys. <coughs> For departures, we invite you to return by 11 a.m. Latest, otherwise changed. Do you change uh, pages? Every morning, a breakfast buffet will be served, blah, blah, blah. Reserves has a Wi-Fi connection. One Wi-Fi 6.9. Hmm. I'm sure you, my security here will die pretty quickly, but uh, maybe I'm wrong. Oh, it's really dark here, and I don't have a flashlight. Probably see more in the stream because I actually brighten them this time, so you can see stuff. Okay. Elevators don't work, I guess. Looks like the elevators are dead. Yeah. Can't use them. Of course. It would be too easy. Let's take the stairs. Come, follow me. So far this game is actually really good. But, shouldn't we check out that room? Sir? Mark? Is that your name? There's another room here we can check. But I don't have my badge. Damn it. Me neither. All right. There has to be a badge around here. Go check out the reception room. I'll go to the lounge room. If anything happens, yell, and I'll show up in no time. You better. But I don't have a gun. Sir? Mark? Flashlight. 
Can I? Oh, yes. You're dead or alive. You look like you're alive. dark in here. This flashlight sucks. Oh, really? Six four one eight six. Ah, there we go. Something tells me that zombie out there is alive. I can hear him in here. And just uh, give me this. There it is. I can't leave Owen behind. Yes, you can. I can't he, leave Owen behind. He is dead. Don't really care. Come on. You were supposed to get out of here. Thank you for everything. Can't shoot him. Well then. Apparently this woman has never played a zombie game. before this monster finds her. Bathroom.
Don't wake up, dude. Nope. I'm out. Stay in there, dude. Don't come out. Let's just keep going up. Should try and be discreet. Okay. Should try and reach the seventh floor, I think. So I'll just keep going up, I guess. Guys, I have to be quiet. I can't go up any further. Hmm. I need to find another way up. Oh. The service stairs might be accessible via this floor. Though I don't think that it's accessing my microphone. That cool though, did. Anyone here? Yeah, you're gonna come out to life, right? You're not dead at all. So we're going this way. Things that are interactive, but not everything. You gonna wake up, dude? No? Okay. Elevators. What the? Ah, yes. Save. So, there are safe rooms, just like Resident Evil. That makes dying a bit more shitty. Ooh, I'll take that, thank you. <sighs> okay, can take that off? Yeah, that's ominous. So you're telling me I'm gonna fight zombies now, right? <sighs> Probably shouldn't talk so loud. I don't know if the mic actually is working. Okay. Okay. So I just need to go around there. To that area. Okay. There has to be thunder. The sound design in this game is brilliant. I'm really enjoying it so far. It's scary as hell, but I like scary. Oh. Dark room. Nah. 
Let's just go to let's go just go to our objective first. Ah, here we go. Conserve batteries. To staff, please do not touch the wires that powers the system. The hotel electrical system is not new, and the power surges are frequent. The bad reader of the uh, service staircase has technically to break down. The control panel is locked. I'm the only technician in the hotel, so I have the key to open it. Come and see me. I will solve the problem quickly. David Lee, dedicated technician. Where are you, David? I was probably dead. So that won't work, I guess. Doesn't seem to work. Nope. Hmm. It's locked. Okay. Then I guess we need a key or something. We just go. Jeez. No, 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 uh, gun, gun, gun. Uh, not a quick draw, so far. Damn your bullet punch! Die! Ugh. Don't do that! Is it gonna do that the whole entire game? Okay, now I got access here at least. Another bathroom? Another locked stall. This time there's nothing here. Are you in there, dude? Yeah. You are. You're probably gonna wake up. And you're gonna wake up as soon as I reach for the key. So enough is enough, Mr. Chapman. You need to talk to the director. We need to have the means to do our job. Davis is always busy at the Johnsons on the third floor. The breakdowns keep happening. With a team, we can see that he's monopolized him as if he was his personal servant. We need him. The hotel needs him. We speak on behalf of all hotel staff. Do something, Mr. Chapman. He might listen to you. Mike, Lucy, Tatiana, and the entire Paradise Hotel staff. Maybe he's still in the director's apartment. Yeah, that's a good guess. Oh, 
Come on. Chains now? Yes, but can't you just... That didn't work. Oh, that doesn't work. Director's apartment B. Jump scares in this thing. Something tells me you'll come alive when I start using this thing.
geplündert. Arrived at Paris Hotel 309, discreet with the room with a good point of view. Suspect scene. The scene corresponds to right records. No personal relationships. Weaving. Unweaving, dude. Camera placed in a hall to control entry and exit. Does not sleep on sight. Departs around 11.45 p.m. Lives at 123 Clearing Boulevard. Seen at his window, ironing his shirt, in-depth stakeouts to consider. I attempted to search the upper floors, but I was spotted by the housekeeper. She looked kind, Ashley Diaz, 23, that's my sister. Uh, in impeccable records. Suspect is back, the price myself on punctuality. Accidents coming from the first floor. I heard screams. Cameras just shown hysterical woman unrelated to the case. Cameras shows violent fights breaking out between customers and staff. It's total chaos. I cross paths with blood-covered individuals wandering around. One tried to bite me. His fate was half-torn. Lost my temper and shot him. He felt that I got back up. I've been barricaded for two weeks now. Help will not come. I'm starving. He's at the end of the uh, chopping block for th uh, these things. I'm not complaining. Many don't get to choose their end. I'm Bill Redfield, undercover as Gary Bowman, FBI agent, ex-agent. Well, at least you didn't. Well, you died somehow, in bloody death. Weird thing is that you didn't turn. This PC is not working. Logic says that since there is no other way out here, something is gonna barge for this door. Mm. <laughs> he looks different, doesn't he? Two different rooms this there I didn't check. Here though. Here we go. Thank you. Well, I think I'd search all of this for. I'd have to go down for.
broken. Good. They probably have what all, all I need. Okay, the only place I can see that we might have missed is actually over in this area. Jesus, how many bullets do you take, you son of a bitch? It's not here. <laughs> Again, son of a bitch.
guess we're going in here. Need to shoot your brains out. in here either. And here's the storage room. Here we might find old cutters. Probably a zombie. a new one actually. How's my health? Max health. Okay.
Okay, Jim. Just calling in this room is one thing. You're the director's son, so be it. But call the last of Hollowrise with the smell of your herbs. Now that's the problem. Better tell me who said sorry to you, otherwise I'll have a chat with your father. Alright, there's such a thing. Step in. Ah, uh, Ashley. director first then we'll go from here Did I lose? Ah, uh, uh, no. There's no quick saves in this. Have to do all of this again. That makes dying really shitty. Come on, 
asshole. Oh, most interested, yeah. Boy, good. David must be here somewhere. Mm -hmm. Probably gonna be hard to kill, right? Match up. Yep, that just based him off. Okay. This music isn't helping. Did a full clip after that, son of a bitch. Quick, 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 quick. Oh. Okay, I just killed my boss. It's all good. Yeah, everything's fine. Does he look like Trump? Just like baseball, this guy. I don't know any of these people. Oh, there's a note on the bridge. Maybe you were so smart to write your code in plain view? Like all the other idiots in this game? I finished the security system. It took a while, but it's now operational. As agreed this morning, we will stick to the temporary code. If you forget, think about a photo of the Cambridge Championship. David. Don't get a bus. Just because I was wearing a baseball shirt, mom called me Carl again before realizing her mistake. I'm sick of this rotten family. I could disappear and no one would notice. Oh, look, Carl. I expelled all the perfect trophies in the perfect living room. I'm out of here. You don't need me. Son. Oh. Okay, let's hide. Ah, here we go. Okay. <laughs> they stayed it. This guy is really obsessed with baseball. There's nothing else in there, though. Another room in here. Oh, shit. Hide, 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 hide. Where's my gun? bedroom oh 
shit. Someone wake up. That's an ominous poster. Okay. Oh shit! Uh, I'm guessing that was the mom. So now I've officially killed the entire family. There's nothing in here either. Okay. Wait. Trophies in the living room. There we go. Salt Lake City. Cambridge, 2015. Doesn't work. There's six digits. <sighs> what did I miss? Okay, that music tells me that something's on its way. Or something's waking up. Please, Mr. Bossman, just stay dead. Can I knock him over the head with this? <laughs> our friend. Yeah, I probably need a full clip. Oh, it's missed. What the fuck? How did I hit his leg? That was smart, though. Still a bullet sponge. That's creepy as fuck. Stay dead. Okay. So. Yeah, so there's dates under these. 2015 is here. 24. Okay. 24. So. Oh, that's weird. 24. So it's 1, 25, 29. I mean, 124. 1, 24, 29. No, that doesn't work. 0, 1, 24, 29? No. Oh. The kid. I need to figure out what his number is. And that, of course, is on his shirt. And of course he's alive. Number four. Okay. Okay, so one, twenty-four, four, twenty-nine. There we go. David, are you in here? No, he's dead. Possibly. Quite very much so. I'm probably hiding in here. And if I'm guessing, he's probably not dead either. Or not dead, dead. Yep. Oh. Okay. Yep. Oh, God. I think I found him. I knew that would happen. No, oh. oh, Jesus. Okay. 
Control panel key. Okay. So I think we have everything we need from this place. But it's time to get the fuck out of here. Because I don't have any bullets left. And if I know game design, this guy's gonna wake up as soon as I start getting out of here. So let's just... Let's just run. Yep. Go, 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 go. Okay. Well, I'm gonna have to open these stairs myself. Yeah, did you figure something else? Jesus. They're all waking up. Come on. Thank God they're not fast. Go, 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 go. And we're safe. Close the door. Close the door. Close it. There we go. Oh, and save. Thank you. But I guess that's a good place to end for the day. I am thoroughly enjoying this game. It's really good. So, yeah, I hope you played it before watching me play it. But this is a good place to end. Thank you guys so much for watching. Remember to like this video if you liked it. Subscribe if you want to. And we'll continue this in the next video. Goodbye.